guys, how you doing out there? This is Kenneth from Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain in my gaming room. I hope you enjoy my um, aquarium curtains. I love them. Um, going to keep them up there. I might put something other, something else up there, but I do like the aquarium ones for right now. All right, so you guys know that when I do my demonstrations, I don't half step them. I don't do these in dark environments and so forth. You know, you know what I'm talking about. A lot of people do their demonstrations and dark environments and say hey look the screen looks amazing a lot of 4k upscaling and all of the crap we don't do that we do hardcore demonstrations here um, I'm gonna be adding some more light in this area because for me it's too dark it's just not enough light but also too I'm gonna be doing some more demonstrations on the uh, black ultra black screen I will be building a screen on my deck that will be four feet high and seven feet wide and that will be um, for my outdoor um, screen I will be using uh, for parties and barbecues and so forth so anyway, we're talking about the Ultra 4K Black. The ability of these screens have amazing contrast levels. These screens can beat out any screen when it comes to contrast. I've done it against the Supernova. You've seen the demonstrations against the Dark Star 9. If you haven't, I'll post them at the bottom of the comments section. If I had made comments about posting videos at the bottom of the comments section, haven't gotten to it, I will. Just been very, very busy. As you guys know, we signed a big contract, so it's been a little interesting the last couple days, so it's going to get even more crazier than that. All right, so to show you the ability and how much contrast that you're losing, well, actually, how much of your picture quality you're losing from your projector, because it doesn't make a difference if you have a 4K, you have a 16K, you have a 1080K, projector 720p doesn't make a difference you are only getting a small fraction of what your projector is capable of doing Ooh, and that is the sample sheet falling off my screen right now let me put that back up there really quick okay I need you to stay get up there to stay all right so um, you're not, you're not getting your when you think you're getting real contrast levels and I have this conversation with people quite a bit who will say look I have a white screen I have a gray screen now mind this isn't this isn't the um, dark silver dark silver is much darker than this this is the uh, bare silver screen um, that I painted on here and so this is one part bare silver screen this is the studio tech 130 by film screens this is using a lot of movie theaters and this will show you the ability of how much you're losing in contrast levels when it comes to your screen. You need contrast. Color, contrast makes your colors pop. All right. So if you notice when I do these demonstrations, you know what I mean. I can show you the difference between our screens. Then basically, some people just somewhat barely matching the screen. All right. So let's get this started right now. We're going to do a little Tron. We've all seen Tron. Some of you have seen Tron on a white screen. You turn your lights on. You're thinking, wow, the contrast just pops. It doesn't. I'm going to show you in this demonstration how much you're losing from your so-called gray screen and the uh, with these light gray screens and the bare silver screen. A lot of you have those. Those of you who have the Studio Tech 130. I've already done the Dark Star 9, so you already seen that and the Supernova against this black screen. All right, so I'm going to remove this right now, and already you can see from the door the difference between. Ooh, that's me falling. Was falling over, breaking my neck. The difference between our dark screen, the gray screen, and the white screen. But you're going to find this quite fascinating. All right, so let me come over here. Let me start this demonstration right now. All right. Now we're doing the bare silver screen, the Studio Tech 130, and our Ultra 4K Black. Look at the advancements of our screen. Now the background in this video, everybody's seen Tron, is black. It's not gray. And that's what you're missing. You're not getting true contrast levels. You're not even getting a good 50% of your projectors, you're not getting 100% of your projectors capability, sorry about that. You are, it doesn't make a difference how high your contrast is on your projector, doesn't make a difference. If you don't have a black screen, you don't have true contrast. Now I'm going to come over here real quick, I'm going to hit the lights to show you that even with the lights off, your white screen and your gray screen will fail. Now you can see that the gray screen, of course, is going to be better than the Studio Tech 130 because the Studio Tech 130 is white. When it gets against our black screen, can't be touched.
Now for those of you that are interested in knowing that can you paint our Ultra 4K black on your pre-existing projection screens, yes you can. This is a roll on screen paint, can be rolled or sprayed, it's up to you. It just shows you how much you're missing, look at that. Look at the difference in our screen compared to what you're seeing. So you're missing a great deal of your picture. Lights come on. Okay guys, I'm Kenneth Bird from Crystal Witch Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. Thank you all for